Hello, good evening. Welcome to Supernatural Figure on a Historic Apostolic Assignment for the Lord. Amen. Let's close our eyes and pray. Heavenly Father, we give you praise, we give you worship. We thank you for blessing us with a brand new day, afternoon, morning, noon, day, evening, midnight. We submit today's program into your care. We thank you for our precious lives. May you always reign supreme in our lives. In Jesus' name, Amen. Today's live stream program, Godly and Biblical Herbs, Spices, Plants, Leaves, Fruits. We're going to study about Gava Leaves. Amen. Gava Leaves, Gava Fruits, and its Benefits. Amen. How do I live without you? Amen. It's both gospel song, love song, and, you know, regular song. Amen. I encourage Gava, okay? As a godly herbalist and apostolic messenger on assignment, my right from God is to promote the herbs, the plants, the seeds, amen, the fruits, and you name it, to the glory of God, amen. I don't have the natural gravel leaves in my house today, but I have shots. I have pictures of how a gravel leaf looks like and how the fruit looks like. So when you go to the supermarket, you know what you are buying for. Okay? This is number one. This is about 12 to 25 pieces, leaves. In the water. Amen. You brew it. When we say brew, that means you are boiling it. And when you finish, you strain, you separate the leaves from the water. Pray over it and then you drink it. I'm going to tell you numbers of diseases. That when you drink the govern brew tea, it heals. Amen. Good. This is guava. This is the guava fruits and the guava leaves. Amen. This is the guava fruits and the guava leaves in the bowl. Amen. Good. I proceed. As a herbalist, I know it's very good and important, amen, to consume guava. Amen. When I was growing up from my mom's palace, guava was everywhere. So me, just imagine, I have armed myself both for second spirit. I didn't know I didn't know much from the age of four growing up. My mom had guava, a big guava tree in her house in her palace so when the fruit comes we enjoy ourselves amen and whenever we feel little sick cold whatever we grab some leaves the fresh ones wash it once twice thrice and then we boil it after 30 minutes we wait till it's warm and then we separate the leaves from the water we pray or whatever gospel song you know you sink over the brew water and then you drink it within a couple of minutes. Whatever it is, if it's cold, malaria, fever, whatever, it vanish. Amen to the glory of God. Good. Guava leaves fight cancer, cholesterol, diabetes, wrinkles. 
arthritis, menstrual pains, menstrual cramps, headaches, cold, fever. It makes your skin or our skin glue. That's the benefit of eating guava fruits. Amen. If you want to brew with, when you go to the supermarket, I encourage you to get a bunch. You can exceed 40 leaves or 30. 30 is too much. Amen. You make sure you have between 12 to 25 leaves. Wash them once, twice, thrice before you add the final water. It could be 8 ounces, 16 ounces. 24 ounces the least. Amen. Brew with between 20 to 30 minutes. When it's warm, you pray over it and you drink it. Amen. To the glory of God. When using the guava leaves, it treats numerous of diseases. I've already mentioned it. Amen. When you are taking a medication, a physical medication, whether being subscribed, prescribed by the doctor or over-the-counter medication, you can take the guava leaves. Amen. You can eat the guava fruits, but you can brew the leaves and drink the water that you boil the leaves to extract from it. Mm. It's not good. It's going to bring you issues and problems, health issues and Health problems. Mm -hmm. Amen. So that's what you do. Give me one minute. I need music at my background. Most cases when I'm streaming, I love to have background music. Amen. Guava fruits. Guava leaves. Is very good for our immune system. It helps our brains, our minds to be extremely healthy. So if you see yourself going down when you're a little stressed out, depressed, depression, and you don't know what to do, Go to the nearest grocery store, the supermarket. See if they have guava leaves. Buy as many as you can and bring it home. Amen. Brew between 12 to 25 leaves. Don't go over it. Over 25 leaves, you're going to you're going to have constipation and it's going to take a while. For you to get your health back is going to cause you a lot of problem. Amen. So you don't want to exceed 25 leaves. You have from 12 to 25. I chose the number 12 because let's say if you have kids, you brew up to 12 for the kids. But if, if, if it's for both adults and kids who are going to drink what you're going to brew, then you definitely go from 12 to 25. Amen. Both men and women who are seeking for the fruit of the womb, the men, when you eat guava fruits, amen, it helps, it helps you with your sperm, amen. When you, um, with the women, women who are seeking for the fruit of the womb, amen. There are herbs. Amen. There are herbs as a godly herbalist, an apostolic herbalist, the Christians. Don't be afraid. This is my office. This is where God has called me. So don't be afraid with the herbs. You don't go to witch doctors for children. Amen. If you don't know where to go, you know my number is 240-474-2901. Seeking for the fruit of the womb. 
and a lot of things. I encourage you if you're seeking for the fruit of the womb as a woman, amen. Don't hesitate. Go to the nearest store, buy yourself some govern fruits, the leaves. Let it be your favorite, amen. Eat the fruits whenever you like it, amen. Trust God and brew the, the herbs, the leaves, and drink it as your tea, amen. And trust God and pray and read your Bible, amen. And live your godly lifestyles as usual. And let's see. I don't call it magic. I call it supernatural. Amen. Great. All right. I believe I've said everything that I need to say. Pertaining to govern. Amen. As always. I'm the founder of Supernatural Apostolic Global Ministries. We are in the United States of America. Amen. Don't hesitate. Um, if you are going through any life crisis pertaining to everything, don't hesitate. Call us and we will be a blessing unto you and your precious loved ones. To the glory of God. Amen. My program is over. Let's close our eyes and pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for being such a wonderful father unto us. We thank you for the knowledge, the understanding, the strength, and the anointing that you have bestowed upon each one of us. I pray you continue to humble me, bless me, break me, mold me, and use me supernaturally to be a blessing unto the body of Christ globally. Even the unbelievers, I pray you use me to touch their lives in order for them to repent, to renew their minds, and come to know you more. And then they will submit themselves and give their life to you permanently. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Bye.